Okay, so some of the peaches now appear ripe. So I want to pick some of them because I saw a bunch of swirls here and they picked up a whole bunch of peaches. These destroyed good peaches. They do is they bite them and they try to eat them and then they won't finish them. They just take them and they just pull them all off. So I'm going to pick out some of the, the bitter ones before the squirrels get to them. And there was one here, which is good. So we're going to pull this one off. It looks fairly well. There's a little hole in it. I'll have to check what that something inside of it. I'm going to just bit it. I don't see any warm in it. So this is good. I can probably try eating this. See what it tastes like. Okay, so I cleaned it off. So let's take a bite. See what it tastes like. A little hot on outside. I found this is juicy. We got some good peaches, juicy peaches. Pick them straight. Try some more. I'll do with this one, I'll save it in the windowsill and uh, we'll preserve it. It looks like another good one right here. This is a good one. Uh, that one's a rotten, rotten end, so I have to throw that one away. So I got these four that look edible. Don't pop it. But the squirrels haven't gotten to yet. So I'll put these in the windowsill, let them ripen a bit, and hopefully you can eat them. And hopefully these other peaches will turn ripe soon. I hope I'll have some peaches to be able to send out. Most of them are still green. And they got harvested peaches on the windowsill. Six of them. Hoping they'll get nice and soft and you need them. Probably just a couple more days in the windowsill. Get warmed up. Nice and juicy.